Yeah, uh Sounds like someone's pulling up. Yeah, just give me a call, grab the camera. The camera yeah, yeah, it's still running. Oh, well, well, well. Good to have you back in the video again. Oh, it's exciting. It's been a minute. Hello. <laughs> and tonight, I've decided, well, we're going to let you choose the experiment we're doing. The, yeah. So you've picked some kind of ritual or game. What, what, what is I have. That? I've been very hard at researching for the last few hours. And I'll be honest, this to me sounds like the absolute best one out of all of them I've read. Okay. And I've read about 70. <laughs> so this game is called, or experiments, uh, it's called Don't Look Behind You. Okay. All right. Why so. don't you look behind you? It's going to be a creepy one. So what we need to do, the setup is basically, like kind of as I am, yeah. myself in a chair here, a middle seat empty, and then yourself beside me, okay? Right. The whole point of the middle chair is we are inviting a demon to join us. So right. what we have to do, sit down, you look face forward, and you cannot look behind you, because apparently, if we do this correctly, if you look behind you and you spot the demon, it will kill you. Hold on. No, no, I'm how sorry. Do you, how do you feel about doing this? I'm excited. I'm not going to lie. I'm genuinely really excited. Right, you're not scared at all. Well, <laughs> we're currently in the comfort of our own home. Ask me that in, like, what, whenever we get there, like, half an hour, and then I'll probably be a bit different. Um, right. So, yeah, so I'm quite excited, but I'll explain a little bit more. So, obviously, the chairs in front of us, we are to put one flashlight behind us facing the ceiling. Okay. Um, so, obviously, if anything is behind us, you'll be able to see it. Um, blah, 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 let me just read this one second. Um, so if you don't take the game seriously, you'll also be killed. So there's two rules. Don't look behind you because there's threat of being killed and don't take the piss basically because it'll, it'll provoke it. Um, you'll be dying to look behind you, but if you do, the demon will attack. Um, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, it's basically us inviting a demon to, to, to sit with us, to join us. Now, so is there do any... not turn your head. All right, is there any particular demon or just as a demon? Um, it's kind of vague if I'm being honest with you. It's not saying a particular demon, unless you yourself, you want to summon one that you know of, and I don't know if that would work personally. No, we'll, we'll, we'll do it how the game says to yeah, do it, right? Yeah. So don't look behind you. Yeah. Just below that, what's that, dry bone? Oh, I've done the dry bones ritual actually Have a long, you? A long oh, okay. time. Like I said, I've, I've read so many today, but I just think this one sounds so exciting. Yeah. And the reason why I'm quite interested by this game in particular, out of all the other ones, experiments, sorry, is we've done a lot of experiments where obviously in in the moment all your senses are tingling you're alive but we can look around can't we like okay. that's what normal people do when you're in a sense of like fear or kind of in a, in a scenario not comfortable you naturally would can like look and feel this one we can't you cannot do it so even if you feel something touch you or you can feel a presence approaching you you can't turn around and that is going to be very testing as a all person right. well I'll tell you what we'll do your game your experiment but we'll turn it more into an experiment anyway because mm -hmm. I've never done this one I used to do urban legends all the time so in this instance we got good old Tesla hiding out amongst the rest <laughs> of the pillows um, we'll put an EMF device in the, in the chair between us yeah right we'll do it at the only place I currently know of at the moment that has chairs like this that we can do that I feel like could work and that would be the Church of the Cursed Book because they have it's church pews the cursed book oh yeah the one with the the, with the death book thing. yeah yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, okay so that's, that's scary uh, actually <laughs> that's where we're gonna do it because okay. I don't actually have any abandoned buildings right now that have three chairs or at least guaranteed to have three chairs mm -hmm. that we can you know fulfill this experiment yeah obviously I got candles I got devices but while we're doing the experiment we'll be checking for EMF spikes and yeah. we will also also uh, be using our devices such as the Alice box and spirit box and we will see if it communicates if if this really works yeah I did also some more research I don't know if you want to know about it yeah, but I did it. research because um, I was curious if I could use my phone like um, you know like when you do it like I don't know like that like a front screen yeah so I was wondering if I front screened it and I could look behind me or use a mirror like a little, a little hand one you're not allowed to do that so I was reading into it a bit so obviously we do it properly so we can't use any reflections or anything to look behind us I literally just play the game as it is but it also said on another website yeah. if you feel it approaching and you don't end the game in time that puts you at for like basically risk and danger so if you genuinely feel that we're being approached by a very bad demonic entity you have to end the game immediately that's mm. what the articles say anyway okay 
Well, I'm down. I'm not afraid. And I'm actually quite excited. Yeah. But I, I'm excited now, but I feel like if, <laughs> as soon as we get there in the dead of night at that church, because I only remember it like ever so slightly because we do obviously so many, like, you know, all the time. Of course. Um, in the middle of nowhere with one flashlight, one demon. <sighs> yeah. Like, um, oh, God. It's going to be interesting, to say the least. Yeah. I'm going to actually, I'm thinking, set up a tripod. So that yeah. we have, because I, I mean, how else are we gonna do? I can't just sit there with with the camera in my hand. No, we we. we but I will set I will set up a tripod, and then anybody who's watching this video, because yeah. supposedly you're saying the demon's supposed to crawl up behind you. That's why you don't look behind yeah. you. That way, anyone can watch head yeah. on and look in the video and see if they see any movement or any kind of anomalies. Well, I think, yeah, I was gonna say what I think is really crazy, and that which is actually gonna be even more scary for me, mm. is this is the first experiment I've ever done with you, except from the Estes method, where we will not know the result until it's edited. So whatever happens, we're not gonna well, know. The behind, no, we're not gonna, we we're won't, not gonna we see. We won't know the behind Unless your results. Unless we get touched or something, and yeah, that's the only way. We won't know those results per yeah. se, but we can still get results with our devices. Oh, yeah, even ourselves. Oh, that creeped me out. What? What? What the hell? I, I actually have chills. What? What the hell? Baby, what? The red lights just started flickering a second ago. Did it? Yeah. <gasps> yeah. The red lights are flickering. They don't do that. And it's three, maybe it's the three of us, the demon and us two. Fucking hell, yes, three, three <laughs> lights just started blinking. Oh, shit. What? Okay, right. Okay, that's reassuring. Let's not overthink it. Maybe, <laughs> maybe we should just get a move on. Yeah. Okay, I'm excited. Your pick, this better be good. I hope so. Okay, babe, so it's about to get a little bit more creepy. Yeah. You're not gonna like this. Go on. But I've just done a bit more research because I'm kind of curious about this game. Okay. There's three things in this that specifically say we're not supposed to do, which we're about to do. So. Right, what are we not supposed to do? Okay, number one, you're apparently supposed to have a childhood object with you, like a toy or something, okay. but it is not allowed to be a stuffed animal. And we have Tesla. Ah, well that's some bad luck. Yeah, uh, so. We're still, we're definitely, <laughs> we are, because, oh god, these roads are I know, horrible. they're really janky. Uh, because um, we want to get the best results, we obviously will be using the EMF bear. So. Well, we will be, yeah, but it specifically says do not use a stuffed animal. Okay. So that was number one. All right. um, number two, which is actually quite a big deal, it says if you've played with spirits or involved with them, um, I, I, how do you pronounce it, Dr Drumason, is that Drumason? correct? Yeah. It says specifically on the on the, uh, the article, if you've played with that spirit, do not play this game because that negative energy actually sparks this game to be a lot more dangerous. Really? Yep, that's what well, Google says. We're in luck because we played Darumazan only a couple weeks ago. I know, I know. So that's what I say. I wanted to research more. Okay. Um, and the last thing, which I find kind of weird, so if one of us get touched, we have to then stand in the corner of the room with our face against the concrete, and I have to be at least 10 foot away from you. 10 foot away? Yeah. So you have, so for example, if so you I got touched. To, so I have to get up out of the chair and walk yeah. to the corner yeah. of the wall and yeah. face it. Oh. On your own, and I'm not allowed to be anywhere near, you'll have to be at least 10 foot away. Or if you get touched, obviously. Well, yeah, yeah, if, if well, obviously if that does happen, then you know, that's gonna be creepy as fuck, number one. Um, but yeah, if it does, that is the rules. You have to stand 10 foot apart. I don't know why, it doesn't actually explain why. Okay. I think it's like maybe like a naughty child. So Maybe it's kind of like in the corner, like punishing you or something, I don't really know. So playing Darumasan makes this game worse. Yes. And no teddy bears. No. Yep, uh, oh. if you get touched, you've got to stand in the corner of a room with your face against the wall, um, and I have to be at least 10 foot away from you. But I don't know what it does, okay? That's the only bit it doesn't actually explain. Yeah, right. So it's kind of creepy, isn't it? Like, yeah, <laughs> I think it's bullshit. I think it's going to be an interesting evening, to say the least, whether it works or not. Yeah, yeah. Well, either way, I think the actual atmosphere is going to be terrifying because all your senses are going to be tingling because you can't look, you know, an innate kind of thing that a human would do out of fear is look at the fear. Yeah. It's, so it's, we can't it's, on this one. Speaking of, uh, Atmospheres, I must yeah. say. Yeah, this is very creepy, isn't it? This is fucking bad. <laughs> the road, look how trash the road is. Well, look at the storm, all the debris at the side of it. Oh, God. It's kind of creepy. All right, let's just get there and do it. Okay. We are 11 minutes away now, so. I think it's going to be a very interesting night. Yeah. This isn't ominous at all. Middle of the night. Oh, shine some light on these tombstones. Oh, God. Yeah, especially knowing what we're about to do. And it's stormy out tonight. Yeah, it's still open. You're the one with the light, yeah? Huh? Just for two seconds, make sure we're alone. 
Hello, church. <laughs> yeah, be sure to see us in here. Right, so this is where we're gonna do it. Um, all the pews, yeah. All the pews are here. There's also a stack of chairs. Yeah, there is. Um, okay, why don't we get the tripod set up, all this stuff set up, and we will do this. This is. Hold on. No, I thought I heard something. Sorry, I'm a bit creeped out. No, all right, yeah, let's get let's get all the equipment set up. Yeah, okay. Okay, Tesla's set up. So far, no activity whatsoever. I have the Alice box. We're going to turn on now. Just see what happens there. And then I have to here. Hold this, please. I have to put one. I think I finally lost my mind, actually. <laughs> I didn't hear anything. Yeah, it was like a Um, Personally, I wouldn't, right. just in case. Right. One candle on the floor yep. behind us. All right, and yes, it is going to be up to everyone else to let us know. Was it? Tell me what it says. Supper. Supper. What was it? Supper is in like food. What was the second word? Empathy. Empathy. Right. So in a second, I'm gonna to have to turn the camera off to do this. I'm gonna leave the camera pointed here. It'll be up to everyone watching to tell us if they see anything behind us. Right. Let's do it then. Okay, and we are rolling. The camera is going to stay stationary while we try these experiments. Tesla's turned on. You got the Alice box on. I mean, sorry, didn't it? Stop. Okay. So what, what were we supposed to say to call So me? you have to sit down. You have to say to the demon, I invite you wherever you are, so we're in the church. I invite you in this church to join us. And, so I can only look, and I can only look forward. Yeah, but as soon as you say those words, which I've just said, so that's kind of stupid, um, from that point forward, you, you do not look anywhere but straight in front of you. And if you want to end the game, um, you just you just literally state that to say I'm ending the session. Well, it's your game, so you say, you say the, the thing. Oh, no. Oh, God. Okay. Wait. Channeling. Channeling. No, don't look. Channeling. Did you not just hear those footsteps behind us? Andrew, don't. I'm not looking. I am covered in chills. Oh no, this is such a bad game. Why are we doing this? I just heard that behind us. Okay. Oh no, don't. My back's tingling. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, bro. I got you. I got Have you. I already invited it? I, 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 just say it. I didn't say it properly. Just okay, say, it say it and look properly. forward. Okay. Just say it and look forward. To the demon of this church, I invite you to join us. What? Is there a demon in the church? Or are we inviting the demon to the church? Vice up. Oh. <laughs> Whatever you think. We invite I, the yeah. demon to join us in this church. Do not look. Andrew, your bag's moving. What? Your bag strap. Look, your bag strap's moving now. Look. Third zipper in. It's doing that. Look. Okay. Plastic. Plastic. We promise not to look back. I am covered in jokes. You know what sucks is because Tesla's, um, the EMF bear, Tesla's uh, sound alarm thing, Yeah. it's not working very well, so I can't actually tell if it's going off. I hear it. Well, I can, I can hear it. I so hear it clicking it slightly. Just don't look. No. People do get wet here. Yeah. If there's a demon here, we invite you to sit next to us and join us. We will not look at you. 
Just please sit beside, beside us, sorry, and make yourself known. This is your chair right here, pal. So if we get touched, we have to stand in the corner. Yeah, but you have to make it clear for us. What was that sound beside you? I don't know, I can't look. Road. Okay. Road. Road. Alright, so let's try communicating. Can you use the device in Kaylee's hand? We'll start with the Alice box and then I have a spirit box in my hand we can try. Can you use the device in Kaylee's hand to answer a couple questions for us? The bear is going absolutely mental. Absolutely mental. Okay. Who are you? Why is the bear going mental? I don't know. Did you hear that sound behind me? Was that outside or was it inside? I don't know. I'm a bit nervous. This is really freaking me the fuck out. Because your natural instinct is to look. Yeah. Lunch. That makes lunch. Amazing. Don't. So they said supper and lunch. Supper. As if. Does that have a? Is that what you think we are? We are food. Right. I'm trying the spirit box. What's it say? Got. Got. Got lunch. I'm getting a really cold breath. Shh. Oh god, I just no, I just stopped. And it just said shh. S H. Shh. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Who are you? Good. 
I hear talking. There was noise over there. I can't look. Where's over there? To my left. Kid. I, I can hear talking to my left. Trap. Trap. It's a trap. I'll tell you if I hear it. What? 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 I can't look. What? Andrew, what? Andrew, what? There's a horrible... End the game, real quick. Okay, we I end the session. The session is over. The game is over. This is the part where I'm afraid was to look, oh, turn around. Okay. Process. You turn around. Process, yes I am processing my thing. Turn around, is there anything behind us? I've already looked, no, no. Okay. This is messed up, yo. It's like a demonic voice. I don't know what it says yet. Right here? Hang on. Right here. Right here. You hear right here? Yeah, I hear right here. Oh yeah, right here. You're right. It says right here. Give us, give us a second. Okay, I shit you not. While I was doing this, the candles turn going out on its own. Shit. Okay. Okay. Candles going out on its own. All right. We'll do one more real quick. Who was that that said they're right here? Right where? Where are you? Oh shit, the bear. This, he's just answered. Where are you? Right here. There's lights going by. No, it's fine. We're, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Check. Check. He just told me to check. I, must have checked. I think there might be somebody out there. I don't know what to do. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, we're just in a church. What's the worst that's going to happen? I know. We should probably just go. It went out. It went out on its own anyway. Yeah, uh,. It sounds like someone's pulling up. It's just they're parking. Park. Yeah, just do, do me a favor, grab the camera. Get the camera on. Yeah, yeah, it's still on. Where's, 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 where's the Alice box? In my pocket. Okay. Yeah, 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 it's 
with the only snowpack. What is the spirit box in the Oh, the camera's right there. Yeah, I was going to say. Oh, I was asking if you could hold it for a second. Oh, shit, sorry. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine, okay, it's fine. Sorry, it's fine. sorry, sorry. Where did all this... Should we just check first and we can come back or do you want to go? Vice also said check, let's check. Oh, great. I'll take camera, you take tripod. Yeah, take it. Yeah, I'm right. Wearing, I'm, I am like, I'm yeah, I know, just let's go. <sighs> Moment of truth. There's a car, there's a car, there's a car, we gotta go, we gotta go. There's a car. Right, just, oh, bat is in, flying in my face. Let, let, let's just go. Oh, shit. Right, um, I'm trying to get directions back up. Uh, a cop car has just driven by very slowly past us. Yeah, it's gone behind, oh, fuck the mirror, can't see. Yeah, the cop's already gone by. Oh, it's already but, gone, okay. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm trying not to Surely it. somebody didn't call the police on us, surely. Don't know. I honestly don't know. <sighs> okay, right. Uh, cool. Wait, phone please. Or camera, whatever. I am on high alert right now. That freaked like, me out. The, EV, the EVP, alert. the spirit box, fucking, oh God. The EVP, the spirit box, like literally everything. I know. Like literally, like I was, that was so weird for me because I, I, I had a tingly back and everything felt so strange. But then it's like, I'm so afraid that I get like a nervous laugh out. And then, know, oh I'm, God, that was I'm, horrible. I'm more that was so horrible. I'm more terrified to look at the footage myself though and see, and then the bear. And your bag zipper moving. And the fucking Alice box told us to come and check. And then a copper just, maybe we should just right. drive up the road first. Come on, let's, let's just go. Let's just drive up the road first because if there's a copper in the area, I don't want to get myself in trouble. All right, let's go. Oh, do you mind holding that? <laughs> That was scary. I know. <laughs> I'm going to have to do that again, I think. Yeah. Um, actually, I would have probably stayed longer if it wasn't for the car pulling up outside. And I heard the car doors closing. Yeah. Went out. I saw it slowly going by. We sat in the car for another minute. And then basically the cop car drove by again slowly. So we were just like, all right, this is too sus now. We should probably go. Do you think someone called on us? Maybe. I don't know. Surely it wasn't just fluke. Like maybe the neighbours saw us. I don't really know. The lights in the church or something wanted them to check. On a it Saturday out. night, they might have just thought the wrong kind of yeah. things. Yeah. But overall, I thought that that was quite freaky, and it got really good results. And I'm looking forward to looking at the rest of it. What did you think? Um, to be honest, I just found it like in insanity. Really, like, like I say, is that when it's when it's like paranormal you're you're kind of like expecting it you, you're wanting proof and evidence okay so yeah. i get very excited when we see like true evidence like kind of come forth the thing that i don't like about that experiment for example is it's so exciting but i am like fucking riddled with like um what's what adrenaline right now and it's like nearly midnight and i'm definitely not sleeping anytime soon because i think it's like knowing you can't turn around it's it's one of those things where should we just sit down i'll get cozy i'll get crazy you can get crazy it's <laughs> on the uh, proving demons cushion um but yeah no, like i say i think it was more being told you're not allowed to do something um that it actually really added the fear and also i kept feeling like my back was all tingly but i don't know if that was genuinely from the fear mm. or if it was something I, I don't i don't really know and I kind of wish we were there longer. I really wanted to stay, but right. I'm glad we left because yeah, well, the cop, the cop was getting sus yeah. with us. Listen, I can do that again. In fact, I don't normally do an urban legend like once, um, or sorry, more than once. Yeah. But this one actually seems to have some interesting um, outcomes with it, and it was honestly fear-inducing. But mm. I don't know. Did you feel anything? Oh, t yeah, I was shitting myself to the whole thing. When the, yeah, I know that, but I mean, like, did you actually feel on your Oh, yeah, I, I, got, I got goosebumps and stuff. Yeah, so did I. Yeah. Well, like, up your back and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. See, I don't know if, it, like, that's actually quite interesting. Maybe we should do a bit of research, because I don't know if that's, like, psychology-wise, that's, like, your body just, like, putting you into, like, the fight or flight kind of thing, or if it actually was something there. I don't really know, so. Don't know, honestly. All I know is I really enjoyed it. I won't deny I loved it. Shit in a brick. <laughs> and I want to do it again. Um, just obviously next time somewhere where we've got a bit more time to play with. Okay. 
Right. Well, on that note, if you guys liked that and you saw anything, leave it in the comments below. Secondly, if you'd like to see us attempt that again, please let me know in the comments below. And hitting the like button and all of that are, is the only way I can actually gather whether it's something worth doing again for you, for you lot. I personally would be interested. I haven't been that nervous during a ghost hunt in quite a while, so it was really good. But with that, everyone, as usual, click this link right here. It's an absolute banger of a video. Don't even think about it. Just click it, and I'll end it as we always do. Do you believe yet?